Hello friends and students. I am Radha. Today I will tell you about sweating. How it is released, its composition, benefits of sweating, why your sweat has smell, emotional sweating, pathological sweating and some suggestions. Human body works best at the temperature 37 degrees Celsius. But when you move from cold to hot place or do some exercise, your body get hotter. Brain doesn't like that and it sends messages to the body to produce sweat. Release There are special glands in your body which produce sweat, also called as perspiration. Sweat leaves your skin through a tiny hole called pores. If you are sitting under a ceiling fan, Sweat dissolves in air and evaporates and you feel cool. Composition Sweat is not pure water. It always contains small amount of solutes like salts, minerals, urea, lactic acids and other waste materials. Maximum sweat rate of an adult is 2 to 4 liters per hour but it is less in children. Sweating benefits It is a very beneficial phenomenon because it reduces your body temperature. When fluids evaporate from your body, it leaves a cooling effect. It also helps to get rid from some waste materials like ammonia and urea. Sweat with smell Your sweat itself has no smell. But when it hurts the bacteria of your body, it creates bad smell. So to avoid that, you should keep your body clean. Emotional Sweating There are two situations in which sweat is released. Number one, physical heat and number two, emotional sweating. Emotionally induced sweat is appearing on palm, soles, armpits and sometimes on forehead while physical heat sweat only occurs throughout the body. Sweat due to some disease is called pathological sweating which appears during heart attack, low sugar level in diabetics, fever, ingestion of toxins, strong emotions or due to a disease hyperthyroidism. Suggestions If there is excessive sweating, it may result with dehydration, so you should keep your body hydrated by drinking more water and using other fluids like lemonades or fruit juices. Stay happy, stay aware, remember me in your prayers. If you find this video helpful, please give me a thumbs up. And if you want to stay connected, don't forget to subscribe my channel.